Good morning from Echo Bay again. It's Monday, February 8th. 6.08, I just got in the water. I just got my first line out. I'm getting ready to throw another one out. So, I'm hoping to uh, duplicate what I did last Friday. Yeah, nice. No guarantees. Stick around. What's the worst that could happen? You see some good scenery? So, yeah. Here we go. I'm gonna hang out in the bay here a bit. Then I'm gonna go out in some deeper water and deep jig for some striper. So, hopefully, we'll get something. Oh, I just lost him. Oh, that's not good at all. That does not make my day. That was a good solid hit too. Huh. Oh, that sucks. All right. I'm finally on. And I think I don't think I'm gonna lose this one. Hopefully not. I just have to fight it. That's a good fish. I can't even remember what lure this is. Oh, it's the plus one. Number one. All right, here's number two. I think he's still there. I can't tell. I think I might have lost him. No, he's still there. Oh, he's just a baby. That's number two. There's some fishies. Those are carp. Yes, indeed. They gone. Earlier on, I thought those might have been striper. Because they're all up and down this bank. Splashing around, making me think they're stripers. Just because they're bored. Those are carp as well, because those, I just past them. So I'm gonna get out here in a little bit deeper water. I got the Mega Bass FX over here and Mega Bass Plus One right here. And this has been producing. This is, I've caught both fish on this today. So Mega Bass uh, Plus One, Plus Two and FX in sexy shad, that's the key for this time of year out here. Dead calm, love it. I'm gonna go out in the channel, put my deep diver on and see what's down low. So we're not done yet. It's still really early, well, it's 9-11, so. But. I don't get to go fishing for 11 days after this, so I'm gonna make the most out of it. Here's my friendly eagle again. Pretty sure that's the same one as I saw last time because he swooped up and, oh, he just went behind that rock. Anyways, he flew up on this rock over here and was watching me for a while, so I'm pretty sure it's the same one. I'm gonna try and get a better Better view of him here in a minute. There he is. He's got a fish. Hmm. 
He's got a fish. He's eating. He's having him some breakfast. There he is. I didn't realize how big he was until he flew like really, really close to me. He's gigantic. All right, I got a few fish and I'm out of the water. I just want to, uh, if you guys that got MKs out there, I did a few things to this that make a world of difference. Uh, I took a piece of aluminum angle iron right here. It's two inch angle iron you get it at Lowe's. And I put three rod holders and a flag holder on it. The one in the middle is for my light. Yeah, I know there's a cheaper way, but I like to have my, I like, I like to be able to swing them around. You know, these are all adjustable. They're Scotty rod holders, Everybody, everybody's seen them. And I got my anchor trolley, or my anchor wizard, right over there. Works awesome. Simple, easy. Easy to do, just bolt it into the uh, mounting plates there. And I got this. This is kind of handy. It's probably really not necessary, but I put it on just, you know, because I, I do a lot of fishing where there's jet skis and boats whizzing around all the time. It's always good to have a little a little more stability when you're standing up. Um, what else did I do? Uh, oh, I'm going to put this right here, this star port. I'm going to put it right here. So you can reach around and, you know, tackle bin, you know, soft plastics, whatever, throw them in there and you can very easily reach around to it, you know, and you can angle it so it doesn't get in the way of that rod. Just like that. I'm gonna, but I put it up there and that just doesn't work. So I'm going to put it right there. That'll work dandy. So there you go. Last day of fishing for like 11 days. And my buddy Robert's already, he's already got plans for that 11th day, or for that 12th day, right here. So, I saw my eagle again. He caught a fish right after I did. Pulled in and watched him eat it. I'm pretty sure he knows that I'm not here to hurt him because I was pretty close and he was just watching me. He wasn't trying to fly away. So we all know the routine. Like and subscribe if you would. I greatly appreciate it. There will always be more awesome scenery. Every now and then I catch a fish. <laughs> and thanks for watching. See you in about 12 days.